In this video, I will demonstrate practical actionable steps that you can take if a key gets broken inside the lock. So stay with me and let's find a solution together, especially if there is no one around to offer assistance. Let's take a look at this scenario. The key has broken off inside the lock cylinder of an electric pallet jack. So how do we handle a situation such as this? Is there any way that we could get the jack to operate by turning it on and off as needed? Yes, there is something that we can do and the solution is actually quite simple. And I'll show you just easy it can be to operate a lock, even with a broken key inside. But before we explore the solution, let's first review what we know about locks. We all understand the basic non-technical principles of how a lock works. First, we insert the car key into the lock. Secondly, we turn the key. And finally, ta-da, the door opens or the device powers on. Now let's apply this principle to this electric jack. Here's what we already know, right? The key is still inside the cylinder. All that's missing is the handle. So how can we turn the electric jack on without the key head itself? It's actually quite simple. All you need is an object that can fit inside the lock and that can turn the cylinder. So a small knife, a nail file, or even a small key can do the trick. Just insert it into the space in the lock cylinder and turn it as you would with the original key. That's it, that's all it takes. And the door will open, or in this case, for the electric pallet jack, it will power on, just as though the key head was attached to the key. So there you have it. If you figured it out, congratulations. If you had a oh moment, thanks for being a part of our problem solving solution. As always, remember to like, share, and subscribe to my channel for more useful tips and content. Stay blessed.